Yes, 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 yes. You know what time it is. You know it's Pierre Nicholson from Florida Star Realty down here in beautiful South Florida. Yes, my microphone went on the fritz again and the audio was horrible. And trust me, I tried everything in my power to, to just save the audio, but I couldn't do it. I couldn't give you guys bad quality for the life of me, man. You know I got delivered the goods. And this is just a little hurdle I got to jump, so I'm going to jump. I promise you it's not on purpose, okay? But look, I'm just giving you this voiceover, okay? And look, man, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Ring that notification bell. So you can be notified every time I drop a new video. Listen, man, I'm out here in Palm Beach County, in Palm Beach Gardens, in this beautiful community called Artistry, and I'm looking at the Michelangelo. Yes, that's right, the Michelangelo, man. We're going to find out in a minute if it's a piece of art. But look, let me tell you about the community real quick. Where this community is situated, before I go into where the community is situated, this is the only man gated community in Palm Beach Gardens. That's right, 24-7, all right? Look, this community is literally 13 minutes away from the beach, okay? It's 23 minutes from the airport, which is Palm Beach Airport, which is an international airport, okay? It's 15 minutes away from Costco, 10 minutes away from Whole Foods, okay? Our local supermarket down here is Publix it's six minutes away from Publix this community is close to restaurants and bars you know so when Rona lifts up you're gonna draw yourself it's an hour and 20 minutes away from Miami and only 45 minutes away from Fort Lauderdale so you're in the middle of everything for real and listen this is the Michelangelo right so it's a three bedroom with a den, three and a half bathroom, club room, three car split garage, okay? For some reason in this model, I only saw two bedrooms, so maybe someone might like it. Look, I'm pointing at the rock. It's really a speaker. I'm going to give you another look at it again. It's an integrated speaker in a rock, man. So your guests are going to be walking up. They're going to be hearing music. They're not going to see where it's coming from. They're going to be tripping out. They're going to be like, oh, man, we about to have a great time. Look three car split garage and i love the stance of this house man beautiful okay look i love the the door paneling on the garage beautiful right and i love the framing of of the garage man right nice See, i'm showing it to you right there skip truck texture on the exterior and we're going into the first garage which is the one car garage you could only access access it through here from outside i wish it connected inside i'm showing you right here is the extra storage in the garage right i'm loving the floors because they epoxy them so the epoxy makes it shiny and gives you that showroom vibes look at that i'm showing it to you again beautiful okay but I wish it connected to the house, but it, it does not. You got to access it from the outside. Okay, let's go in. So now, yes, I love the natural lighting this house gets. Beautiful French doors. Frost is my favorite. And man, oh man, look at that floor. Look at that beautiful ceiling, man. Look, when you enter this space, you just know it's somewhere special. It's undeniable, man undeniable so anybody come and see you they're gonna know what's up beautiful 48 by 48 tiles on the floor beautiful stained mirror i love these little touches man look at the tray ceiling man and the pop outs and they put little capstones on the on, on the ends look at that man it's giving you an extra vibe the hair and bone wood in the in the tray beautiful man and it is capped this baby off with a beautiful light fixture, man. That is beautiful. Look, man, they're giving you all the flavors, man. They should have named this house uh, Michelangelo. They should name this house Baskin Robbins. You know what I mean? <laughs> but anyways, let's go in, man. Beautiful. Let me open this up. Nice. Yo, this is a nice linen closet, man. I love the shelving. I, it, the, 
it, it, it gives me like a little beach vibes, the way the shelves look. I like it, man. All right, close that baby back up. Let's go check out the bedroom. Man, look at this bedroom, man. And look what it did to the walls. They put the wood on the walls and they painted the whole vibe white. And they went crazy. So it goes all the way up to the ceiling and goes to the next side of the room and then comes down. This is crazy, man. Beautiful life fixture that's popping this whole vibe out. But this is a vibe that, you know, touches like these make a house luxury, okay? So you got your plain wall, but when you slap the wood on it like this, and you get a professional to do it. Because you just don't want to just get it done. You want to get it professionally done, seamless. The seams is like connected together. It almost look like you bought it like that. You know what I mean? I love the baseboard, which is beautiful. Okay, look like five inches on the baseboard with a little extra molding on it. It transitions from the carpet to this beautiful. That look like 12 by 48 tile, man. That is nice. Okay, nice. Undermounted sink. Inch thick on the slab. That's coarse, baby. Yeah, definitely. Undermounted sink. Again, I'm pointing to it. That looking like... Uh, Nice, I'm pointing at the natural windows, right? I'm going through it with y'all, <laughs> right? Nice, all right? I love the tub. I love the mosaic, right? And I love how they they made the um, subway tiles vertical in length, so it makes the tub look bigger. And I love this mosaic. It has a little organic vibe to it, man. Okay, beautiful, two-tone, three, it look, three-tone mosaic. Nice, okay? And look at mosaic, man. It, it got so much different textures in it. Wait till I get up close to the mosaic and show you the vibes. Okay, look at that. Be look at that. Oh my word. Nice, beautiful mosaic, man. I love how they picked it out for this, man. It really pops out the space. Okay, nice. All right, man. Let's go check out that closet. Let's see what we're working with. Okay. Natural lighting in here. I love it. Nice walk-in closet. Decent, man. Very decent walk-in closet. Beautiful room, man. Okay? All right, let's see what the rest of the vibes is. Look, we even haven't... We haven't even left the foyer, foyer yet. We're still in the foyer. If you if you remember, look. <laughs> we got some more house to see. This is only one level, people. Okay, for all you one-story uh, house fans, this is it, man. Beautiful office, man. This is nice, man. Yeah, they got it like a half wing as a desk. I like that vibe. So you could get something like that. But look at the shelving. I love the beautiful open shelving. The wood shelving. This is nice, man. Woo! Look at the stone on this, man. Waterfall. Yo, look. It's a waterfall like shelving. This is beautiful, man. Look at this. They put the waterfall in the office, man. And that almost looked like that white diamond, man. Just look how it sparkles, man. That is beautiful. Loving the fiction. Look at this. So, look. How are you going to be working with all this wine in your office, man? This is crazy. This is like a legit, real wine room, man. Encased in glass. And they got mirror all over in it to make it even look bigger. Look at that. That is beautiful, man. You can hold a nice collection of wine in here, man, for real. Like, how you get the work done? This is like right off the office, man. So even if you was trying to get some work in and there's a little gathering going on, they could be in and out of this office getting the wine out. So might as well either stop the work and just go in, okay? And you guys be saying, oh, Pierre, we be talking about party houses. And look at this. Am I lying? Look at this. This is crazy, man. The amount of wine you can fit in here, man. And look, if you really look at it, I'm here counting it. If you really look at it, it's they only put one wine on the rack, but two wines could go on each rack. And look how much racks are there. You do the math. Okay? Pause the video and count it. I'm pointing at the, the table. I know that won't come with the house, but that looks beautiful. I like how they did it. If you get a small table like that and do your vibes, man, it's gonna stand out, man. Okay? Beautiful. All right. So, look. Let's check out the rest of this house, man. All right. Nice. 
I love this tall doorway. And look at the, the mold around the casing of this door, man. And then look how it's symmetrical to the other side where it has the mirror. Okay? And then look at the stone right here, man. The, the two texture stone, man. This is crazy, man. One side got a mirror, one side got a doorway. That is nice. So we're entering. I love the little feature wall right there. Look to your left. Nice bathroom, okay? Uh, the colors are nice. I like how they, they painted it. It wouldn't be my first vibe, but, you know, it's good. I love the mirror. The mirror itself looks like a piece of art. Beautiful pedestal, sink, toilet. In here, got plenty of room, okay? This is a big powder room. All right, what else is here? Nice. Love the little feature walls right here, the little cubes and stuff. You could do the same vibe in your house. Okay, I love this little nook right here. This little white stone, not white stone, this little diamond, white diamond vibes. Nice. I think they could, they locked the garage, but beautiful laundry room, man. Like in the backsplash, shaker style cabinets. Okay, nice. Take a gander. I love the natural lighting, right? I love the slab of rock, front loaders. So you know it's gonna give you a lot of space atop soft clothes. Dovetails, I can see from here, dovetails, soft clothes, man. Look at that. And I love the jewelry on this baby, man. It's looking nice. Okay, let's go. Oh, the garage was open. Yeah. I love how they um, epoxy the floors, of course. Give you that showroom vibes. It keeps it nice and shiny. Okay. Of course, you got your lift master. There go your electrical panel. Okay, there go your hot water heater. Okay, nice. Nice size garage, man. All right, let's go. Yeah, man. So this is a nice one-story house, man. There go the alarm system. Okay, nice. It's a smart house. Okay. And then you got Honeywell on the AC. All right. Man, can we get out the foyer? We didn't see the rest of the house yet, man. We're still in the foyer, man. And this is only a one-story house. Imagine if it was two stories. Beautiful ceilings, man. And you know what? The ceiling is not... This is not a tray ceiling. Oh, this is the tray ceiling. Beautiful den, man. So you get an office space and you get a beautiful den. And look, they put the crown and the tray the crown molding in the tray beautiful and i love that futuristic fan man that is beautiful and look at the design and the tray you know that's probably wallpaper and look if you say wallpaper ain't back you're lying it's all the way back baby okay i love the natural lighting that comes into this room right and you know what i want to pick these colors man but these colors are nice man they look luxury for real this is the way they did it with a with a nice dark gray with the light gray or light grayish brown whatever you want to call that man this is nice man and you can put any size tv there 65 inches or more i love the wood trimmings they put on on the side man and look how they matched it oh that's like leather it's like a le leather wall man and look how they match the trimmings to the lines of the leather wall and it gives you some open shelving to break up the space but still keep it open at the same time man that is beautiful man nice beautiful space you got room for a table a couch in there yo this is crazy man here go the family room with that light fixture just dripping down in the center of it man this is beautiful man you got a big big feature wall and then you got this this is not this look like a tray ceiling but this is a crazy this is a pop out with the wood inside of it giving you that little um it almost looks like herringbone but it's not touching so it's like little di diagonal vibes and then they put the uh, can light in and the pop out this is nice man this is a very unique way man many flavors this house have man many flavors very unique uh um lighting fixture man it is great I just love how it drips down to the center of the family room, okay? And they give you that two uh, textured uh, mosaic back here, man. That is nice, man. 
this is a nice um, building for the for the TV, man. You could put you could put a bigger TV there. You could put 85 inches or more. Yeah, it got enough space for that. And I'm pointing right there. I'm saying you could put a little mini can lighting in there to to help pop out the artwork. So I'm thinking in there is missing a little bit of lighting to help pop that out. You can put some on the top and the bottom, whatever have you. Leave it as is. Okay. Now we're going into the kitchen. Man, look at this. Look at the light fixtures, man. This is looking nice. Okay. And I'm loving the cabinets. I'm loving the built out around the fridge. I'm loving how the light is popping the backsplash out. Okay, shaky style cabinets, and I love how the top of the cabinet's got the, it's glass. Of course, that's an upgrade, okay? Look at this. This is beautiful, man. Loving the shaker style cabinet. Let me see if it's dovetails. Put that out. There you go. That's all the proof you need. Dovetails, soft, close. Come on, man. This, this, this cabinet's going to last you for a while. Yeah, I was I fell in love with the cups. I know it don't come with the house, but it's different, man. It's the cups that lean to the side, so if you pour stuff in there, man, it's crazy. Even where you keep the 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 alcohol in, it leans to the side. So that's crazy. So if you're drinking, you're leaning, the cups leaning. <laughs> what a party, man. Look at this beautiful waterfall island. And look how it just waterfalls right into that big beautiful. 48 by 48 town man that's beautiful and look at this walk-in pantry get your life man you got space for days especially on the top shelves man look at that this is crazy man this is beautiful okay nice man this is a nice treat for this house and I love the stone they chose for this kitchen, man. They use one stone. They didn't try to mismatch you. And that's a proper big body island. This is the, this is the microwave right here, of course. Uh, being under that is the oven. Okay, boom. Nice. Okay. I like the backsplash. is nice. Okay, let me see. But it's white grout. Okay, so if you're cooking and, and, and food splash and all that, you might have to end up regrout it quicker than than, than, would you, than you want to. Yes, dovetail over here too. Okay, you got your stove top, um, five burner gas stove, okay, which is nice. And then you got your range hood with the glass on it, which is nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking about the splashing the food on the backsplash and possibly regrouting sooner than you want. That's why I say, look, man, if you can, do a design where you, you see the stone on, on the counter stone, you just run it all the way up, make it seamless, or pick a grout that's a, a gracian color, you know, so it, it, a design that, that encompass that. Beautiful big pot drawers, okay? But if you don't care, man, then it's a party, baby. Do you, boo, okay? And look at this push button garbage disposal upgrade deep sink gooseneck faucet under mount deep sink come on baby lift that out dovetails on the island beautiful okay and look at this beautiful um this is definitely the formal dining with two light fixtures beautiful man i love the feature look, every wall in this house is a feature wall by the way now this is a true tray ceiling with the crown molding in the tray and they put some wallpaper in there to pop that baby out with four can lighting this is beautiful and they got the mold inside the tray and the mold outside of the tray on on the wall man this this gives it an extra that's right pop man you know i don't know about the curtains but hey to each his or her own okay yes woo Look at this light fixture, man, on this wall. I almost forgot about this. This is different. That is nice, man. They're putting the mirrors all over the place to make the place look bigger. You know, that's what they do. So you can have to, you put the mirrors in your house or you don't have to. It's up to you. Okay. Yeah, I'm in love with the train. And look, look how that looks like a runaway. Like a plane is ready to land. <laughs> or land or take off. Or you about to take off. You guess look at that. And you guys just take off into that fun zone. And look at this. This is where the open concept really shines. Because look, you basically stand anywhere in the house and basically see anywhere in the house. Look, look around. 
Okay, and I love how each room just flows into each other, but still feels separate, man. That's nice. And look at the slides, man. Am I gonna open it or what, man? Let's show the people the vibes. Let me see, I hope it slides into a pocket. I don't remember. It would be a treat if it did. No, it didn't. Okay, but look, you know I'm not gonna show it to you off the top. I'm gonna walk back and then show you the vibes. Hey, that's not bad. That's a good indoor outdoor flow. Yeah, this that's pretty nice. Okay, so when I hear, look, I'm pointing the speakers in the room, so you know what I'm talking about when the music is pumping, when the food is smelling through the whole air, that nice food, when you got that solo cup or that nice glass of wine in your hand, you already know what time it is, man. We're having fun, okay, with no permission, all right? You know, I'm always checking the lip to see um, to see if it's trippable. You know, you might I, my foot was bumping, so you might have to, you know, instruct the guest, say, hey, look, watch out for that. It's a little bit of a lip. Watch out for it. Step over and do your thing, okay? Look, you got a feature wall outside with a fireplace in your backyard. And look, man, you got a nice beautiful covered terrace man so this is gonna come in handy when it's raining or if it's really hot outside it's gonna provide you some beautiful shade nice you got the grill with the slab of rock and the fridge down there okay you got a nice big table this table might be a little bit too big for the space but you know they're trying to show you they can put big tables back here but it might be a little bit too big why say that that chair is too close to the grill man you can't be, you look, you can't be, be, I can't even talk right now. You can't be beside the the barbecue chef. Why he's doing his thing? Look at that. That's a no-go. Come on, man. The chef is going to be elbowing you all day. So if this table is a little bit short, yes, yeah, it would be nice, man. Because guess what? When the chef is is got his apron on and he's cooking, I'm telling you, look, yeah, I'm telling you, I'm pointing like this is where I would cut the table off. When the chef is cooking, he need elbow room, man. You can't be in his way, Okay. All right, man, but look, that's beside the point because I know when you get in your house, look, you're going to do it right, okay? Anyways, hey, look, man, this music is bumping. Man, all right, man, look, we're continuing. I'm loving the wall. You got to skip trout texture outside, which is beautiful. Let me look around the corner. Oh, you got an extra space over here. I can see people talking, chilling. You know, this party just spilled over here. We can have extra chairs, whatever. But I, honestly, I can see people standing up. They're talking. They're having different conversations. It's like multiple conversations going on in the party. And every view of this from, from this backyard is beautiful. Okay? You got right here, you got a lazy pool so you can put chairs in there so, and be in the water but not really be in the water and have adult beverage in your hand. Vibing. Somebody could just come. Be in their full clothes, just take off the shoes, get their feet wet, sit down in the chair. It's a different vibe, man. And look, they got these um, these steps. Look, I'm actually walking across it, right? Because I want to show you the stance of the house, man. Look at that. And then you got these multiple waterfall situations coming down. This is nice, man. And I walked across those um, steps, no problem, man. I didn't feel like I was going to slip and bust my head or nothing, Okay. This is a beautiful lap pool. You can say, man, how is this a lap pool? Look how small it is. I'll sh soon show you the secret why this is a lap pool, man. Blow your mind. Okay, look. And they got multiple seating around the side. Look at that seating. Man, this is a party pool, man. With the jets. Look how the jets are just blowing, man. Look, it's blowing your body and blowing your mind. Look at that. Beautiful. Take a gander. Nice, man. Look. Okay, look. This is why I call it a lap pool. Look at this. There go the secret, man. You know what this does? This blows the water towards you. So it's like you're on a treadmill. This is a treadmill for pools. So once the water starts blowing towards you, it's called an endless pool, right? Once the water is blown towards you, you're swimming, and you could you could you could set the the um the speed so you're swimming at the pace you can swim, right? And it's like you're in one spot, 
so it's like you're in a lap pool. So essentially, it made your pool bigger. It's called an endless pool. Beautiful name, okay? Look at it. I can't get over it. Yes, I used to swim in high school. I loved it. I played a, a hundred different sports, okay? I was an active guy in high school, man. I was in engineering clubs and everything, okay? Beautiful. Okay, I'm going around the side. I'm showing you the the pool pump, okay? Nice. Beautiful. Very elaborate, okay? And I lo look, I love how they, they kind of hit it and covered it in a little area. That's nice. Taste, done to taste. They didn't just put it out there. They actually try to hide it and make the space look nice. They're thinking of you, okay? I like stuff like that. All right, man. Time to go back inside and just look at it, man. I know I didn't ask you guys this already, but could you see yourself living here? Take your time. Look around. I know my answer will be yes. Okay? Look, if you haven't already, hit that like button, man. Let's bring this video to over 100 likes because everybody got to see it, man. Beautiful open floor concept. The finishings are done nicely to taste, man. And I can't wait to see that master bedroom, man. Look, when you enter into a bedroom and it has a little mini foyer like this, you know you're in for a little treat. All right, look, let's go in, man. Because I'm ready to be blown away just like y'all. Let's do this. Nice. Okay. And let me see. Let's go in. I'm seeing tray ceilings. I'm seeing a casing around the tray ceiling. I'm seeing all types of stuff. I love how it transitions to the wood on the floor. I love that light fixture, man. Come on. Give it a little spin. There you go. Nice. Okay. Again, they brought the stain mirror in the room which is nice a nice little touch all right i love all the natural lighting that comes into this room they put a chair they turn the chair around to the side i don't know why they did that um but yes it's big enough to have a chair in the room i'm showing you the dresser because it's very unique yes you can get your own vibes but that's nice that's a nice little touch whoever the interior designer is man please comment down below man Look, man, thumbs up to you. You did a great job just putting this house together. Okay, little minor, little minor stuff I would change, but overall, hey, okay? They did a step-down tray. Why? Because it's like steps. They got the wood on one side. Look, see this step, you step up, and then they frame this baby out with the wood, like a wood casing. That is nice, man. They put four can lighting in it. Beautiful, man. I love, I love how they did that. And look how the wood casing around the tray ceilings is matching the wood that's behind the bed that's encasing the stained mirrors, man. That's beautiful. Man, this music is pumping, boy. Woo! This is driving this whole tour. All right, look. So we're about to go into the bedroom, the bathroom, I mean. Okay. Let me see what's going on behind this door number one. Beautiful linen closet. Nice. I love these beach shelves. It feels like I'm on vacation. Okay? Which it is a vacation every day down here in South Florida. Beautiful tiles. Okay? I love the, the toilet with the molding on the top of the toilet. Yeah, I'm pointing to it. It looks like you got a lot of elbow room in here. Okay? And you got a natural lighting in here. That is nice. Alright? You got your... I'm seeing a big old tub. I'm seeing those beautiful vessel sinks. Okay. I love the slab on, on the on, on the um vanity. It looks like that white diamond. It's just sparkling in your face. Alright. Beautiful vessel sinks again. I'm seeing it. Big custom frameless mirror. Man, it is giving it the all to you. They even put a plant in the middle. Just to show you that. Look, look how much space we got. <laughs> It's having a plan. It looks like a mini tree. Okay, I love the light fixtures. It's hanging out the, the ceiling, which is nice. Beautiful tub. And I love the little 
mosaic vibes they put on the outside of the tub, which is nice. And I love these tiles, basic tiles, man, but it does a trick. When you put everything together, it's nice. And I love the natural lighting that's coming in here and the can lighting and the ceiling. Nice. All right, let's look. Beautiful frameless shower, man. Open this baby. Yes. And look, I like how, I like functional designs. I like how the tub turns into a seat for the shower, man. And I love how they continue that mosaic vibes in the shower right there, man. Let's look on the floor. Nice. All right, close this baby up. Let's go into the closet. It's transitioning from this 48 by 48 tile into this nice wood that's in the closet. And this is a nice closet, man. Look, if they didn't, if I, if I didn't see the, 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 the ties, the guy's shirts and the ties, I would just say this, this closet is all hers and he would have to find his own. But this is nice, okay? If you're sharing it, she getting the bigger side of, uh, of the closet. And I guess it's split by the middle in there. Okay, it's split by right here. But all this is her, you see the bags. Even, I see girl shoes right here. And I guess guys, you just get the little corner. <laughs> it is what it is sometimes, man. Just be happy, okay? Look, if she ain't happy, then man, look, it's not gonna happen, you know I'm telling the truth. Boom, look at that, that's beautiful. That's where you put your belts. Or if she was felt sorry for you, she'll put, uh, help make you use that for, for your ties. Okay, but that's where you put the belts, man. Oh, she got another vibe. So you know what? She might give that to you, you know? Nice. Okay, this might be the jewelry drawer right here. Oh, you can lock it. So that's, a, yeah, so I'll put like a the little foam in there for the jewelry. And then since that got the lock, you could actually lock it and feel safe with it. I think that's a nice little touch, man. I, you don't see that too much in a lot of closet build-outs. You don't see that period in the closet build-outs, the, the lock for the um, the top drawer. Yeah, that is nice, man. Yeah, I'm pointing to it, man. Very impressive. So I would just put, you know how sometimes you, 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 the, the top drawer is a jewelry drawer and, you could, and they got the little slots in there for your rings and all of that. That would be a nice touch to do. So I'm turning the camera on myself. So I'm letting you know, man, if you haven't already, you are crazy. Hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you can be notified every time I drop a new video. And if you want more information on this house or any other residential property down here in South Florida, anywhere in West Palm Beach, Fort Lauderdale, Miami, Boca Raton, give me a call, send me a text, send me an email, even leave a comment down below and I'll be glad to help, definitely. Okay, again, my name is Pierre Nicholson from Florida Star Realty down here in beautiful South Florida. Thank you guys for watching this video. A hey, big up to all my subscribers, man. We way over 700 subscribers right now. This channel's growing fast all because of y'all. Thank y'all. Until next time. Peace.